Hi there, Nate here with another Paisley Pointer. Now is the cold weather or the looming threat of flu season getting you down? You need warm holiday drinks. Ah. We've got just the ones that will give you the warm and fuzzies this holiday season. This drink is really easy to make. Combine one 12 ounce container of cranberry concentrate, three and a half cups of orange juice, and about a liter of your favorite lemon lime soda. Mix well and enjoy. This drink's good because it is sweet with a little fizz and some tang. Who doesn't like a cup of hot wassail to relax with? You just need four ingredients for this one. In a saucepan, combine four cups of apple cider with four orange peels and 12 whole cloves and a few cinnamon sticks. Let boil for three to five minutes. Then strain out the solids and enjoy your delicious amber concoction. You can garnish with a clementine skewer or an orange slice. This one is sure to warm you up on those cold nights, only for grown-ups though. In a large saucepan, heat up four cups of your favorite hot chocolate, measure off four ounces of Sky Cherry Infusions Vodka, and mix in. Measure two ounces of white creme de coco and add to the mix. And lastly, add four ounces of half and half. Stir well and heat to almost boiling. For a garnish, top with whipped cream, red sugar sprinkles, and a maraschino cherry. If you like eggnog from the store, you will love this. If you don't like eggnog from the store, you'll still love it. And this recipe is safe for pregnant women. In a large pot, combine 6 cups of 1% milk with 1 8th teaspoon each of ground cloves, cinnamon, and nutmeg. Bring to a small boil. In a separate bowl, combine 2 tablespoons of flour, 1 4th teaspoon of salt, 2 thirds cup of sugar, and 2 eggs. Whisk together until even consistency. Once your milk reaches a boil, slowly incorporate the milk into your egg mixture. Using a strainer and some cheesecloth, remove all solid particles from the eggnog. Once strained, add two teaspoons of vanilla and stir well. Return to the pot and place on a small burner. Stir consistently until temperature reaches 160 degrees Fahrenheit, but do not allow it to boil. Transfer into a bowl and cover with plastic. Refrigerate for at least 8 hours. Once chilled, mix in 1 4th cup of whipping cream until color is even throughout. Ladle into glass and dust with nutmeg if desired. Mmm, that is like pure distilled holiday happiness in a cup. Hope you enjoy these recipes, have fun in the holidays. Is it good? It's really good. Delicious. Mm -hmm. So then I said, look, I'm Rick and James. <laughs> <laughs> this is where you laugh. <laughs> that, that was the funny though. The other phone I found, I was knock knock. Who's there? Mary and Abby. Mary and Abby who? Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. <laughs> <laughs>